Hello everyone, this is Shabnam here. Welcome back to my channel, The Counseling Corner. In my previous video, I have spoken about vitamin D deficiency, its causes, signs and symptoms, uh, the benefits of vitamin D, uh, the daily uh, you no know, recommended dosage, as well as the sources of vitamin D. In today's video, I am going to speak about how the toxicity of vitamin D, also known as the hypervitaminosis, can become life-threatening if it is not identified promptly. So how does this vitamin D toxicity happen? It does not happen by, it is actually very rare and it does not happen no, by exposing, exposing yourself to the sunlight or by consuming the vitamin D fortified food. But it happens when we take overdosage of supplements or when we consume improperly labeled supplements. Vitamin D becomes toxic if it exceeds 100 nanogram per milliliter and as per the research the optimum level would be somewhere between 30 to 60 nanogram per milliliter and this would help us to fight against the infections. So now let's see what would happen if vitamin D bec uh, no, becomes toxic that is if it exceeds 100 nanogram per milliliter. It will lead to the increase in the calcium level in the blood which is known as hypercalcemia and you would experience both physical and mental symptoms. Physical symptoms would include fatigue, headache, dizziness, aches you know, and pains in the bones and muscles, uh, frequent urination leading to dehydration, stomach problems like diarrhea, vomiting, nausea, loss of appetite. Uh, increase in blood pressure leading to heart problems. It might also affect kidney. You might develop kidney stones, kidney injury as well as in some cases kidney failure. And the mental symptoms would include uh, confusion, disorganization, some may experience hallucination, depression and even psychosis. I would like to share one of my experience. As per doctor's advice, I have to take calcium uh, supplements throughout my life. And recently, uh, no, like uh, as COVID, uh, as they're talking about the third wave of COVID, everyone was uh, suggesting, no, that vitamin D is very essential to fight the infect COVID infection. So without realizing that I have been consuming uh, D3 along with the calcium tablet, I had uh, no consumed uh, nearly three weeks, I had consumed vitamin D supplement that is 600 IU. After which I had developed severe body pain, I had a metallic taste in my mouth, severe headache and nausea when I used to wake up in the morning. And then I had been to the doctor, you know, and because I was assuming that these are the symptoms of COVID. Uh, so doctor said, no, I didn't because I did not have any fever. I did not have cold or cough or nothing, you no, know, no throat pain or anything like that. And he advised me to go in for a blood test. And it was identified that my vitamin D3 is nearing toxicity. That is, that is it was 96 uh, nanogram per milliliter. And doctor said, all these symptoms which I am experiencing is because of high level of T3 and he asked me to immediately stop with all my supplements but I had to continue with my calcium. I checked with, with um, I don't know, a couple of medical shops but I did not get any plain calcium. Every calcium supplement had vitamin D content in it. Then doctor advised me to go in for some commercial pro product from uh, no, to order something from Amazon but I was not getting any plain calcium. So finally my sister suggested and I have placed an order for a product in healthy hay which is known as uh, no, Calm 72. So sometimes what I would like to say is see we are so busy in our lives, see we miss on these small things, we don't check what is the content of the supplements which we are taking and sometimes we take overdosage you know, of vitamins, you know, or listening to our friends or, you know, or suggestions or family members suggestions because we really trust them and they are well wishers. So it would always be better to you know, get the blood test done and then take any supplement by consulting your doctor. So hope this information was useful to you and in case it was useful to you, please do give me a thumbs up, do subscribe to my channel The Counseling Corner, share my video with your friends and most importantly hit the bell icon so that you get timely notifications whenever I post my new video.